Hello everybody, this is David from goldstartool.com and uh, uh, today I'm gonna go over the Juki Smart Solution G Juki DDL-9000C um, and I wonder how come they don't have the, two, the DDL-9000C back here but they have it now in the back. The logo and everything is right in the back. So we're gonna, we have a customer for a, an order we have a order for a customer, not a customer for an <laughs> order. Order for a customer that is going out today. I just uh, thought we're gonna go ahead and um, go over this beautiful, beautiful machine. As you know, New Take, we also make a machine like this, but uh, we call it uh, New Take uh, GC 9000C. Uh, but this is a Juki. Uh, uh, Smart Solution DDL-9000C SMS. There are a uh, couple of different, if you could come back here. Um, yes, you see that 9000C? Right there. Juki Corporation, still made in China. Still made in China, if you could see that tiny. Still made in China. Juki though, a beautiful machine made by Juki. Fully, fully automated. But this is the DDL-9000 CSMS. There are uh, another one that is more expensive. This is about sixteen, seventeen hundred dollars range. At least for now, 2019, end of 2019. It could be more or less, but just wanna go over a couple of things, show you the tables and legs. But before we do anything, we're gonna explain something very, very, very important to you guys. So this is a direct drive machine. That means that there is no external motor this is a servo motor inside here, the head. Now, this machine is made for Europe, Asia, USA. 110, 220, and 220, three phase. So, when you buy this machine, they do not um, offer the machine with one of these on and off switch. And that's the reason that I left it out, just to show you guys. We assembled the machine, everything's done. But I left this out to show you what I mean by it. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the machine. I'm gonna unplug this, the cable. The fan is still going on. But I'm gonna open this up to tell you, to show you what I'm trying to let you know right now. So, since, since the machine is good for either 110, 220 and here goes my uh, screw. I wanna try to get it. Uh, here goes my $2 million face. <laughs> All right, so very simple. This is an on and off switch. And in USA, you have only 110, three wires, okay? You have positive, negative, and you have ground. But the cable that goes to the machine, which is the control box right here, has four wires. So when you receive this, you do not panic. If you're in USA, or you do 220 single phase, you just cut the red wire right here. You see the red one, we cut it. And you only use the other remaining wires, which is green for ground, goes like to the body of the switch, and positive and negative. Those two doesn't matter where they go, okay? So, on the other end, obviously, you have a wire that goes right here. Now, within our uh, shipping dock in the back end, the background is not very, nice but people love to see uh, not a studio or a setup or a fake thing this mm -hmm. is real this is what happens here every day at goldstartool.com orders come in and uh, when we, whenever we get a chance we just take some videos for our dear customers so number one when you get the machine if it's unassembled this machine is going out assembled ready to go so you're not gonna have any problem. Is your hand hurting? No. No, I'm gonna buy you one of those uh, <laughs> gadgets. Um, so 
If it's assembled, you're not gonna have any problem. If it's unassembled, you receive it and say, oh my God, there's four wires going into the machine and I have only three here. You just cut the red. Don't worry about the inside. You're not gonna, this machine is capable of getting 110, one, I mean 220 single phase and 220 uh, three phase. Okay, so we're gonna pause and then we're gonna come back and what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put this back on and we're gonna continue on the uh, uh, operation of the sewing machine. Okay, so we put back the switch as you could see and we turn on the machine. Now, when you turn on the machine, this is exactly what you see. But before we go on, I'm gonna just, it's a normal table, but I know people are gonna ask. It's the same exact table that we have on our uh, uh, website, 47 by 20. The bed of the machine is 20 by seven. The neck from the needle all the way to the neck is one feet exactly, 12 inches. What comes with the machine? Not, the, not a lot of stuff. Um, first of all, Juki is gonna go paperless, so you could find all the manuals and parts books inside Juki website. Uh, needle which is the same needle as DDL8700, DDL8700-7, DBX, DBX1, bobbin, one bobbin, packer needle, which I think there is only two or four inside, a uh, couple of screwdrivers, and there is actually a uh, uh, funny, uh, one of these thread guys that actually has to go here, okay? But, uh, doesn't matter, we didn't put it in there. I'm gonna put it on later, but exactly that's how you put it in there and you just, bam, bang it in, bang, bam. Okay, that's it. Now, and then it's gonna go in there and the thread is gonna go from there. That's not a big deal. You're gonna get uh, the serial uh, number, oiler, uh, dust cover. Uh, this is uh, not a big deal and a tiny, tiny, tiny safety data sheet for DDL-9000C, and here what we have. Here we have the SC-950, SC-951, that's the control box down there, okay? So, when you receive the machine, uh, everything's gonna be there, meaning all the holes. I'm talking about back here. There are four holes right here. One, two, three, four. For the uh, computer box. That's gonna go there. All right? That's all you need. Everything else is there. You're gonna receive the ball joint. You're gonna receive everything that you see here. And it's gonna be very simple. This is the leg K legs, okay? And you're gonna have the hole for the thread stand here. You're gonna have the oil. You're gonna have this uh, uh, pin for the oil for the head rest. When the head comes back, all the way back here. All right, now, you're gonna have a hole back here for all the uh, wires to go in there. So this machine comes in one complete uh, intact with all these wires. And very simple, you just open this up. There are four screws here. And one, two right here, three here, and four here. You open this panel out and there are wires in there. Exactly, there are, the plugs are exact. You know where you're gonna go with this. You're not gonna make any mistake. I could open it up, I'm not gonna open it up. You're gonna see a bunch of uh, electrical wiring and you're gonna get very um, nervous. Mm -hmm. Don't get nervous, everything's in numbers and you just plug it in there. Now, zoom in here, please. 
You're gonna see this, 220. You see that? Don't worry about it. It said 220, 240, that means that this machine could also do 220, 240, but actually could do 110 and 220 single phase and 220 three phase. And uh, there are a bunch of Japanese written stuff that doesn't matter. These are the hinges for the machine, all right? All you have to do is to put those hinges in, put the machine in there, assemble the K legs and the table the same way that you do it in our other YouTube videos, the same way, all right? Here, I'm gonna shut off the machine again. Pull, push this back. This is really, really heavy. When you get the oil, put all the oil in here, in there. That's it. And it has actually, there should be a, a gauge that tells you how much oil after you, first of all, you put everything in there. And then uh, there is a gauge that shows you how much oil you need right here. I'm sorry. This is the gauge. All right. After you need more oil in here, it tells you how much more you have to put in there. This is reverse. And this is reverse. I'm gonna turn the machine on. This is a bobbin winder. Simple, like all the bobbin winders. Thread from here. Another one. Through the uh, thread uh, tension. And that's why you need tools. You go out, right? And then you get your bobbin or any bobbin. Let me just get it out. So bobbin. Goes in there. People are gonna call and say, it doesn't go in there. Don't worry about it. Push it down. It's gonna be hard. Push it down, all right? Pull. And twist around the bobbin. That's how we say twist. Turn. And then when you sew, here, I wanna be here. When you sew, it's gonna go up and down. This is the whole idea that when you're sewing, see, it's going up and down, ba 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 ba. And when it finishes, it stops. Okay? I'm just gonna stop there. All right? Done, done. Okay? Same way you thread. Threading. Now, we missed this part, not me. Whoever put this machine together forgot to put this in, or we're gonna ship this out. Actually, sometimes we don't put this in because of the shipping goes from the first hole, coming back second hole, the same way that you do any sewing machine. And then you have, you're gonna put it through this, through the needle, down. Now, when you turn on the machine, you're gonna see this, right? Very simple, speed up, down, see the cutter? You could adjust, what do you wanna do? Cut, don't cut with this one. Everything is here, speed up, speed down, Memory, this is, and let me just go ahead to the clear everything, return. Okay, now you wanna get this one, start sewing. Now you're gonna, you wanna go back, you just go, either press this, you see that, and then when you wanna stop, you just stop, press, up, done. Look, now, I'm gonna go back, you see, there are everything in here digitalized. By the way, you see the screen here? That means that you are in good shape. Number two, here is an SUV plug, if you wanna put in program in there, okay? Now, again, Juki does not provide one of those 
speak fat owner's manual anymore because they want you, people want to save the world and all the green and the, you know what's going on. So no paperwork. You go on their website and you download whatever you want. These are, I got rid of the, you could, this one, up, down. If you want more zigzag, more start and finish, you could get rid of it. When you finish, start, back, stitching, you want or you don't want, let's see. See, it didn't do it. It's different between this and this. Now if you want, put in here yes, yes, and it's gonna do four times. Four times going, four times going back. And you could take those, these are the stitching. You could go up, woohoo. Okay, uh, let me do this. Guys, believe me, some of these things I am, um, I did this before, but I, all right. Okay, this is a stitch length. You could do the stitch length, high, less, or more. All right, let me do this here too. Let me go back. I really want to do the stitch length here, and I know this is the stitch length right here, and that's how you're gonna uh, just here. We're doing a stitch length right now, and that's millimeter. Wow, four millimeter. Gotta go back, right? Yay, yeah, you see the stitch length? It's an unbelievable sewing machine. It's gonna take a little bit of learning, but it's very easy. I did not read the book, I did not see the book, I don't know the anything about the owner's manual, but you could go to our website. Is on the top right below the picture. You could see the web, the owner's manual, part books, and all of that stuff. So very simple. Read the book. You see what's happening uh, with stitching. Start, finish, memory. I think up to 100 different type of uh, mem uh, memory you could put in there. A stitch length right here. This uh, you could do reverse, and then you could drop the. Uh, Drop the feed dog. That's how you could do this. Is for you could bring it all the way down the feed dog. So, um, the, if you don't want to cut, you just get rid of cutting. But I'm not going to touch that. All that bobbin winding, how fast you want to go, how much you have on this. This it tells you exactly how much you have on the uh, bobbin. There are so many stuff that uh, you're going to love. A great, great machine overall. Make sure you put oil in there before you start sewing. Um, I just quiet. And we're gonna do, this is a regular fabric, I'm gonna double. So now we have five layers. Look at that, I'm gonna do four and four, that would be eight. You could change plate, feed dog, you could add folders here, bias folder, anything you want. A great machine, tension. I uh, I would do up any type, look, look at this. Really heavy stuff. A great, great machine overall. Speed adjust, um, stitch adjustment, everything could be done from right here. And go on uh, Juki site on our website, goldstartool.com and you could download uh, the owner's manual and everything. So, um, uh, it would be a great thing. Now, uh, one more thing that I wanted to tell you is that I don't think the oil goes here. I made a mistake. The oil does not go here. The oil goes here. And uh, that's what I'm sure of. I don't think the oil goes here. No, the oil does not go there. The oil goes to here. Oil goes right in here. Do not put the oil here. I made a mistake. 
Yeah, I just found out that the oil is in here. This is, uh, this is uh, uh, the way it goes. Just take this out and put the oil right in there. And you have, that's why you have one of these things. All right. I hope uh, you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, thank you for watching David at goldstartool.com. Again, the oil only goes in here, that then goes to the pan uh, because of the, I see that there is a reservoir here for the oil and there are a lot of uh, um, um, tubes. tubes and stuff down there, electricity, even though there is the oil pan here just for the oil, if, if it, the oil drops, uh, so it won't drop on your floor, but the oil goes right in here. Uh, thank you for watching. David from goldstartool.com.